friends and I am back. I am Saram Khan studying 5th standard and today we have mechanics for JEE main and advanced basic mathematics subjective questions question number 6th and 7th. As we know what question number 6th and 7th are so we are going to begin by question number 6th. So here our solution will start. Now our question number 6 is asking to us that find the value of tan 105 degree. We have to find the value of tan 105 degree. So 6 will solve here. So what we have? tan of 105 degree. Now to tan 105 degree in a different form can we write? Just like can we write it in this form? Okay tan 60 degree plus 45 degree can we write it such of course we can write it such because 60 degree plus 45 degree equals to 105 degree and here also tan is and here also now so first of all we'll write to tan 105 degree in this form tan bracket 60 degree plus 45 degree and bracket close this we have now to this we'll try to evaluate so when we'll evaluate this so what we'll get tan 60 degree plus 45 degree this we have to evaluate so what will we get tan 60 degree plus tan 45 degree okay the, by using the compound compound formula okay divided by 1 minus tan 60 degree tan tan 45 degree tan 45 degree this we can get of course this we can get okay what we have tan 60 degree plus tan 45 degree then we eva will evaluate this so what we'll get of course we'll get tan 60 degree plus tan 45 degree now divided by will divided by 1 minus 1 is in formula 1 minus tan 60 degree multiplied by tan 45 degree this we have now to this we'll evaluate so what we'll get tan 60 degree equals to root 3 so root 3 plus 1 because we know tan 45 degree value is 1 now divided by now 1 minus as it is will write now tan 60 degree root 3 tan 45 degree 1 so 1 minus root 3 into 1 as we know we first multiply so what we'll get which is equals to root 3 plus 1 divided by root 3 in min 1 minus root 3 into 1 is root 3 itself so what we have okay so finally what we got this value is root 3 plus 1 divided by 1 minus root 3 so what we have it actually then tan 105 degree is also equals to root 3 plus 1 by 1 minus root 3 so this is the final answer so the answer for first is root 3 plus 1 divided by 1 minus root 3 now we'll solve for seventh okay so seventh question is also very similar and it is also of same process so it will be very easy for us to solve so now here question number seventh is asking to us okay that find the value of cos 67 degree what we have to find the value of cos 67 degree this we have cos 67 degree now to cos 67 degree how can we write cos 67 degree can be written can it be written in this form cos 30 degree plus 37 degree can it be written in this form of course it can be written cos 30 degree plus 37 degree where here brackets are now by this by this value we'll try to solve it so while solving it so let me tell you the one about one identity it okay whenever we get such just like cos bracket a plus b okay now bracket close so here value is always equals to cos a plus cos b minus sin a plus sin uh, sorry cos a letter cos b minus sin a sin b so this we can write as cos 30 degree okay cos 30 degree letter cos 37 degree here bracket also we can put now okay now minus will do sin 30 degree okay sin 30 degree times sin 37 degree this we have to do what we have cos 30 degree times cos 37 degree minus sin 30 degree times sin 37 degree now to this we have to evaluate so while evaluating what will get cos 30 degree value what is its value that is root 3 by 2 now root 3 by 2 times now cos 37 degree it is 4 by 5 4 by 5 minus sin 30 degree what is the value of sin 30 degree and we all know very well that sin 30 degree value is 1 by 2 okay times now sin 37 degree what is value of sin 37 degree that is 3 by 5 
this we have now this we got finally now to this we'll evaluate which is equals to root 3 by 2 multiplied by 4 by 5 first we know we do multiplication so root 3 into 4 4 root 3 4 root 3 by 2 into 5 is 10 now minus here minus is 3 1 into 3 is 3 now by 2 into 5 is 10. So finally what we got 4 root 3 by 10 minus 3 by 10. So to this one we'll evaluate. So it will happen upon 10. Okay. Down 10 will be. Now here what we'll get 4 root 3 minus 3. Okay. As numerator because for, we are subtracting 4 root 3 by 10 minus 3 by 10. In earlier classes we have studied while solving such so whenever those okay whenever those are like fractions or like rational numbers so we take the which we take the denominator as same only one denominator we take and we subtract only the numerators so what we are getting 4 root 3 minus 3 by 10 this we are getting so finally what we can write that actually cos 37 degree equals to 4 root 3 minus 3 by 10. So this is the final answer. So the answer for 7th is cos 37 degree equals to 4 root 3 minus 3 by 10. So this was my today's topic. Thank you.